Well, since the first season of Love & Hip Hop Miami, I've been working so much. I barely get to sleep, but it's most definitely a blessing because I'm, I, I feel like my dreams are really coming true. Life since season one has been crazy. I'm talking about everywhere I go, I can't go to the grocery store without a person noticing me or coming up to me, asking me for a picture, asking me am I okay after my breakup. The DMs got a little bit heavier. <laughs> Tax bracket changed a little bit. Demographic of women in my DM changed a little bit, but actresses and stuff, <laughs> you know. I feel more pressure now than I've ever felt to release more music and more content and more things as an artist for my fans to feel satisfied. Life since season one has been phenomenal. I've had a lot of opportunities, it has opened up a lot of doors for me. I've been traveling, I've been performing everywhere. I've done Essence, the cover of People in Espanol. I came out in Rolling Stone as one of the top 10 artists to look out for. I mean, I've done so much, it's been crazy. Well, since taping season one, the difference is I'm getting along with my neighbors now. Neighbors that didn't speak to the rapper Trick Daddy, they'll speak to Trick Daddy from Love and Hip Hop. And they'll let me in my gate without my ID. Life is great for me, actually, always. I'm always busy and always working, so it's pretty much the same. Um, it's a different energy this time. I'm way more engaged. Life after season one has been amazing. <laughs>Yo, welcome to the 305 Love and Hip Hop fam. But go ahead and do yourself a favor. Subscribe to the VH1 YouTube channel. That way you won't miss none of the action. I am the Daddy Dollars, and I approve this message.